have seen what we thought was unseeable. We have seen and taken a picture of a black hole. Here it is. For decades, scientists have known that black holes exist. But you know, seeing is believing. And so finally, now they see. It took them two years to get this photo right. It took eight telescopes from around the world to coordinate with just the right weather and just the right timing. And the stars literally had to align. And they finally got this image of a black hole 53 million light years away. Black holes are so named because they've got such extraordinarily strong gravity that even light itself can't escape. And if you could see a black hole, and we've all seen a pretty good reconstruction of one in Chris Nolan's Interstellar movie, you'll see a kind of black disk, which is where light can't escape, and then there's a whole load of material sweeping around the black hole in something called an accretion disk. And you get this sort of funhouse mirror effect because general relativity predicts that um, space and time are warped by extreme gravity. So you're almost seeing light that's whizzing around and across the black hole and so on, but you can't see into the hole itself. <laughs> The Event Horizon Telescope is a project of coordinating different telescopes all over the world in simultaneous observations to image a black hole. So the way it works is all of these telescopes around the world look at the same object at the same time. They're coordinated with atomic clocks to synchronize them. And all that data is combined after the fact into uh, what's called a correlator. And that correlator is ultimately produces data that can be constructed into an image. From a distance, black holes seem wondrous, but up close, they are the most terrifying things in the universe. 